Let's learn about UK wildlife. With a focus on mini beasts. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's an ant. Across the world, there are roughly 13,000 species of ants. There are 50 different species of ant that can be found in the UK. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a woodlouse. Woodlice have 14 legs and an outer shell called an exoskeleton. An exoskeleton is on the outside of the animal and protects the body, unlike humans who have internal skeletons. Do you know which mini beast has created this? It's a spider. Spiders are not insects. Insects have six legs and a spider has... That's right, eight. Most spiders also have eight eyes too. Spiders belong to a group of animals called arachnids. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a bee. These buzzing beauties are one of the most important animals on our planet. That's because they help lots of plants to grow by pollinating them. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a dragonfly. Dragonflies have been around for a very long time, over 300 million years. Whoa! Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a worm. Worms do not have any lungs, but breathe through their skin, which must remain moist to absorb oxygen through the air. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a ladybird. Do you know ladybirds can fly? They have a colourful shell that protects their wings. The ladybird's shell also helps to warn predators away with its bright colours. I bet you know the name of this mini beast. It's a butterfly. There are 59 species of butterfly that can be seen in the UK. These are some that you might see in your gardens. The Red Admiral. Small Tortoise Shell. Comma. Painted Ladies. And my favourite, which is the peacock butterfly. Do you know which mini beast made this trail on the ground? It's a snail. A snail has a shell on its back. If it feels threatened, a snail will hide away in the shell until the danger has passed. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's a slug. Unlike a snail, slugs do not have a shell on their back. 
slugs are mainly nocturnal, so that means they are active during the night. Do you know the name of this mini beast? It's an earwig. Earwigs are omnivores. This means that they eat both plants and other insects too. There are lots of other mini beasts that live in the UK. Can you name any of them? Give yourselves a well done for super listening. And as always, please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Help my channel reach new people by pressing that subscribe button and you will also keep updated with all my new videos. Thanks. Take care. Bye for now.